Welcome back everyone. Today, we are diving into a topic that is unfortunately all too common in the workplace. Gaslighting. Did you ever feel undermined at work? Would you believe that a study by the National Workplace Institute found that nearly one in five employees have experienced some form of gaslighting from a colleague or manager? Yes, it's true, that's a significant number of people dealing with this harmful, manipulative behavior every day. But you might wonder, what is gaslighting? How can you spot it? Picture this scenario. You've poured your heart and soul into a project, burning the midnight oil, surpassing expectations, yet your boss persistently criticizes your work, with comments like, you're not doing enough or this doesn't meet our standards. Doubts start creeping in about your abilities and you question your perception of reality. That, my friends, is gaslighting. Those who gaslight are masters at manipulating situations and bending the truth, making you feel like you're losing your mind. They might deny ever saying something even when you have proof, claim credit for your work while simultaneously criticizing it, make you feel like you're always overreacting or misinterpreting situations, exploit your personal vulnerabilities to control you. Gaslighting can wreak havoc on your mental health, leading to anxiety, depression, and even burnout. It can make you question your self-worth and distance you from your colleagues. But here's the silver lining. You're not alone. If these warning signs hit close to home, it's crucial to ask for help. Speak to a trusted friend, family member, therapist, or HR representative. Document everything, keeping a record of interactions with the gaslighter, noting dates, times, and specific instances of their behavior. And remember, this is not your fault. Gaslighting is about control and power, not your inadequacies. So how can you combat gaslighting at work? Set boundaries. Avoid getting sucked into unproductive conversations with the gaslighter. Trust your instincts. Don't let them warp your reality. Cultivate a support network. Surround yourself with positive people who can help you navigate this difficult time. Seek professional help. A therapist can equip you with the tools and strategies to deal with the emotional fallout of gaslighting. Always remember, you deserve to feel safe and respected at work. Don't let a gaslighter rob you of your happiness and power. If this video struck a chord with you, do hit the like button and share your experiences with workplace gaslighting in the comments below. Together, we can create a supportive community for those grappling with this issue. And remember to hit the subscribe button for more empowering and insightful content. Spread the word and help us raise awareness about gaslighting at work. You never know who might need to hear this message.